Well, music has a way of healing the soul. A group of St. Louis musicians are using their talents to help heal those affected in Ukraine. Fox News' Amelia McGavro joins us live now from Kirkwood, where a special concert took place. Amelia? Yeah, Mandy Shirley, the concert was held here at the First Presbyterian Church of Kirkwood. And tonight, musicians from all over the St. Louis area volunteered their time to be part of this performance with a purpose. With the flare of the baton, this music is making a difference. So easy to feel powerless, I think, through everything that's going on. And as musicians, I think we have a unique opportunity to bring people together through our art. Louis Privatera came up with the idea to put on an hour-long charity concert where all the money raised would go to Ukrainian refugees. We just sent emails. Uh, sent texts, calls, and, and luckily we have a really generous musical community here in St. Louis and everyone was like, yeah, I'm in. Some professional musicians even volunteering their time, like conductor Wendy Lee from the Metropolitan Orchestra of St. Louis. Songs included everything from Mozart to the Ukrainian anthem. attended did not hesitate to donate what they could. Concert goer Arthur McDonald says he feels good helping in this small way. It's just a horrible feeling and, and many of us have never been any, through anything like that, but we can certainly sympathize with all those um, citizens and what they're going through and we want to help them. Privatera hopes this act will inspire others to know they too can make a difference. So if this even just reminds people that these things are still happening and if we can find power within ourselves just to do something, whether it's even just to raise a few hundred dollars, like let's do it. And all the money raised goes to Presbyterian Disaster Aid, which will then distribute that money to the Ukrainian refugees. And you can also donate online and we'll have a link inside the story on fox2now.com. Live in Kirkwood, Amelia McGovro, Fox 2 News.